King's assassination hit Boston with a particularly heavy impact. And there was a sense of loss that was very personal on the part of many people in the city. And then we heard the um, smashing of um, windows and the cars were honking going down the street. People were crying and screaming and uh, it became very chaotic at that point. Among the many potential hotspots that loomed over the city was a James Brown concert scheduled for the next night at Boston Garden. Harvard Law student Tom Atkins, Boston's only black city councilman, became the liaison between Roxbury and the mayor's office. I received a call from Jimmy Bird. He called me at City Hall to say that there was a problem, and that the problem was that a concert scheduled by James Brown for Boston Garden uh, was about to be canceled by the city. His concert, we thought, might bring as many as 15 or 20,000 black people from the community, particularly young people, into the city. It, it just had too much emotion in it not to decide whether that would be, uh, that would be a problem. 